for Finners, the season's now less than a week away. Uh, first home games just over, just under two weeks away. Um, how are things going commercially, and how, how are we looking up here in the Steve Roberts sponsorship suite for the first few games? It's going really well off the pitch commercially. We've got a lot of uh, a lot of our main sponsors in. Uh, we can still do a little bit more, um, so we're still looking for new businesses to come in, come in and get involved with the club. Um, hospitality wise, we've got quite a lot booked in for the big games, so Swindon, Forest Green, Coventry, Luton are going really well. In fact, most of them are full now. Um, but we do have availability for every other game, for match sponsorship, pre-match dining. Um, and we're going to do a special offer for the first three games. So um, any of the first three league games, um, we're going to do at pre-match dining at £35 plus VAT. Uh, or £25 plus VAT for a season ticket holder. Um, so a £10 discount there for season ticket holders. Um, sponsorship will be discounted heavily as well. So anybody interested in sponsoring the, one of the first three games, match or match ball, uh, we can do a really good deal on that as well. You mentioned the, the, the discount for season ticket holders. What exactly do you get in the pre-match dining? Obviously it's not just, people might think it's just for sort of businesses and commercial people. What, what would you get? If oh you're yeah, absolutely. Dining? Open to anybody. Uh, we don't have a, a minimum number of guests. Um, it can be ones, twos. You know, we do get individuals come up or couples. Uh, and it suits, you know, your, your normal supporter. You don't have to be a business to come in the sponsorship suite. Um, you get car parking, your match ticket, you get a two course meal half-time refreshments, uh, a team sheet and the programme. Uh, there's a, a pay bar available and uh, we normally have a, a match day host, either Martin Miles or, or Tom Watt uh, around and, and, and myself. Um, so we, you know, it's a great atmosphere when we get a few in here. So hopefully with the offer that we're putting out now, we'll get a, a good mix of businesses and, and supporters in here as well. And if they're interested, how, how do they get involved? How, how can they contact you? They can call me at the club, 01242 588 107 is my direct line. Um, or they can email me, john.finnegan at ctfc.com. A new thing we've got going on this year is the CTFC privilege card. And a lot of it the, 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 the comes with the season tickets. Yeah. Um, people have been asking what exactly they are. I thought we'd ask, ask the man himself, well, what, what are they? Yeah, it's just something we came up with towards the end of last season. And we, you know, it's season ticket holders we keep asking them to come back and renew their season tickets and, and spend their hard-earned money with the club and we thought it'd be a, a good opportunity to try and give them something back so they will have found a, a card in their season ticket back, um, pouch and uh, basically what we're looking to do is go out to our sponsors or businesses around the town to see if they're willing to offer our season tickets ticket holders discounts so um, just off the top of my head, a few, a few that are involved is Andy's Barbers on Bath Road. He's going to offer a discount to uh, privileged card holders. Uh, the Spice Lodge already do something in the match day programme. They have discounts for season ticket holders or anybody with the programme with the voucher. Uh, Johnny Rocks, the chauffeur, he's going to do a discount for the first um, chauffeur booking that anybody wants. Um, and there's one or two others that I can't think of off the top of my head. but. Any of our sponsors are more than welcome to join the scheme, so whether it be painter and decorators or maybe a gym membership or something like that, we might be able to help season ticket holders get discounts around the town and maybe the old restaurant and cinema maybe and things like that. But we'll be approaching quite a lot of different businesses to, uh, to try and give the season ticket holders some value. Yeah, we'll put all that information on the website um, when, when those new deals come in and things like that. Yeah. Um, it's not just for season ticket holders though, isn't it? It's, it's for all fans, is that right? Yeah, yeah, season ticket holders have all received the card already, but we will be making these cards available once we have enough uh, businesses involved uh, where they, they can be purchased for a small fee. Um, but generally, it was the idea was made so we could give something back to the season yeah. ticket holders. Yeah. We've had two home games here this pre-season. Um, first sighting of our new scoreboard. How pleased are you with it and the commercial opportunities it brings along? Really pleased. Uh, there's one or two tweaks that we're, we're looking to do. Some of the... Um, some of the writing and, and messages on there were a little bit too small, so we, you know, we're learning as we're progressing. Um, we all James, need a pre-season. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, you know, James is doing a great job. He's spent a lot of the summer putting a lot of hard work in, and uh, a lot of it's coming to fruition already. Um, but there's, just, there's still quite a lot of exciting new stuff to go on there that we haven't shown yet in pre-season, and uh, so we're kind of similar to the guys on the pitch. We've still got a bit more in the bank and a bit more to offer than what we've shown so far. Talk about on the pitch, you're looking forward to the new season? I am, yeah, yeah. Um, it's been a tough pre-season. I think, you know, we're, we're all the first to admit that. Um, but, you don't, you know, nobody wins no medals in pre-season. We've seen good pre-seasons and poor seasons follow and, and vice versa. So, uh, 
always looking forward to a new season, you know, great new pitch, Matt's done a great job out there, the scoreboard's in, the new goals, you know, we've got new board members and, and lots of stuff going on behind the scenes, so uh, yeah, really excited uh, for, the, for the Crawley game now. Cheers, Dennis. Thank you.